An air of mystery still surrounds the death of John Wilkes Booth. There's even some doubt as to whether it was really Booth who died in that barn outside Port Royal, Virginia. It all began in the early morning hours of April 26, 1865, when Booth and his co-conspirator, David Harold, were surrounded by a cavalry regiment while sleeping in a barn. They had been on the run for 12 days, Booth limping badly with a broken leg. Harold quickly surrendered, but the heavily armed Booth refused. The cavalry set the barn on fire, and as Booth hobbled about inside the burning structure, Sergeant Thomas Corbett shot him, severing his spinal cord. Booth lingered on for several hours, writhing in agony. Though an examination by army doctors proved conclusively it was Booth who had died, it didn't stop persistent rumors that he remained alive and on the run. U.S. Senator Garrett Davis of Kentucky even proclaimed, there's a most inexplicable mystery about this whole affair while on the Senate floor. A mystery perhaps, but inexplicable it was not. 